I'm a little tired this morning, but let's see if we can put this outfit together. <laughs> let's get dressed. <laughs> Good morning, Sharon here, Ageless Restyling. Thank you so much for joining me for another Let's Get Dressed. As I said in my intro, I'm a little bit tired this morning. I am dragging. But let's see if I can put this outfit together. I just kind of pulled pieces. Let's see if it comes together and it works. Fingers crossed, thumbs up. Well, yeah, fingers crossed. <laughs> yeah, I'm tired. Anyhow, so let's get started. So. I will be wearing um, olive green today. So I'm gonna be wearing this olive green pants. And this is actually a men's pants that I thrifted. And then this top from Leah and Viola. And this is also thrifted, but this is thrifted from labels. So I think these should work together. So let me put them on and I'll be right back. Okay, we're at the halfway mark. Pants and blouse is on. So this is what we have so far. What do you think? I love these pants. The fabric is wonderful. I forgot to check the fabric content, but I the reason why I love men's pants so much is because it, um, the pleating in the front that they have. I love that style. So, anyhow, now for shoes. Let's put the shoes on. So I'm going to wear boots. As you can see, I also put the little, you know, socks on because <laughs> I knew I was going to wear boots. So I'm wearing um, this. What color is this? It's like a burgundy, purpley color. I don't know. And these boots are, who are these boots? I don't know, who are these boots? <laughs> There's no name at the bottom. Okay, these are open edit. So these boots are open edit and I'm wearing them today. I think I'm trying to remember where they came from I don't know I don't remember <laughs> but they are open edit I think they came from Bloomingdale's if I'm not mistaken I can't remember <laughs> so let's see how this color looks with the olive green because it's this color is really a neutral. So just gonna add just a hint of color. Let me get these slippers out the way. What do you think? Huh? I hope it looks good when I look in the mirror because like I said, I just kind of like threw things. <laughs> because I'm a little tired today and I have to go to a training seminar. <sighs> but, say la vie. Okay, let's see. I like it. I like the color combination. I was not sure about it. So I had a backup, backup pair of neutral boots just in case. <laughs> I was unsure about this color combination, but I happen to like it. What do you think? Yes, I'm glad it worked because I didn't want to have to take the boots back off again. I like this combo. Yep, 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 yep. All right, so let's put the belt on. So I'm gonna be um, adding this um, snake print belt here. I think this is going to be just what the doctor ordered. And like I tell you guys, almost all of my belt, like this, if they're like this, they're thrifted. And this is a leather belt. So normally I thrift my belt for
from like from goodwill most of my belts i thrifted i thrift from goodwill because you could get great leather belt thrifted for like two two three dollars <laughs> seriously leather so this is what we have going on so far see that see the belt i hope you can see the belt <laughs> added a little snake print in there okay now for the jewelry um I brought in two necklaces because I wasn't sure. Like I said, I kind of just pulled things out and kind of threw them together. So if I put on this necklace and I like it, I may not change and put another one on because... <laughs> and I happen to like this one. I think it works. I like this one. So... <laughs> I'm not even going to try the other one. I'm going to go with this one. <laughs> so I said, if the first one that I put on, I really, really like, I'm just going to go with it. Yeah. I'm going to go with this one. All right. So since I went with this necklace, I brought some earrings in. And I, let's, let's try this one. So here is the earring that I brought in with the necklace. Okay, yep. This is it. Yep, 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 yep. All right. A little bold today with the earring and the necklace. I like it, yes. I like your selection. All right, now what's next? Bag. <laughs> this is where I um. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But let me let me show you the selection that I pulled out. So first we have this one. Okay, this one is um my coach bag, and it matches the shoes. I think it matches the shoes perfectly. So here is Coach. What's your thought? What do you think about Coach? Okay. And then I found this vintage clutch that I thrifted from a consignment shop in Miami. It's vintage. It's beautiful. Snake print love 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 this clutch obviously i can use it as a you know shoulder bag but when i carry it i just like to use it as a clutch and drop that in there but anyhow so this is the clutch and i selected this snake print vintage clutch love it oh love this because of the belt <laughs> so what do you think of this one <laughs> i actually like this <laughs> neutral but this clutch does not excite me not at all not like the other clutch and the um the um coach bag does so i'm gonna say no to this one so it's between these two and I have to make a decision because I got to skid skid out a lot of here. I'm running late. Okay. 
Okay, so it's between these two. So let me see. This little bag is just, it's a little bit more roomy. Does it, do I have my, yeah, but it does have a strap. So this provides just a little bit more room. Let me put the strap on. Just in case I want to use the strap. Mm. I don't even know why I put the strap on because I won't use the strap. <laughs> because I'm a top hand of the kind of person. <laughs> If I was going shopping, I would use the strap as a crossbody, but I'm not going shopping, so I won't use the strap. You know, for work, I'm a top handle kind of person. Top handle or a clutch. So we have this one. I don't know. Okay. Let's put the bag aside. Now it's it is it's not cold, but it's chilly, so I, I just need a, a little um outer layer. So I'm thinking, <laughs> let me check the outer layer and then see. I was thinking just kind of like throwing this leather jacket. Oh, I like this. Let's see how this look with the bag. What do you think? How does this look? And let's see how it looks with this what do you think <laughs> and to make things to complicate things further <laughs> let's see this color i think is it too bright i don't know way both of these jackets are thrifted the leather jacket is thrifted and this jacket is thrifted okay all right immediately this is a no for me immediately immediately no 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 so that was pretty quick so i know now that it's going to be the leather jacket so now the question is, which bag? <laughs> All right, so let's see. Oh, Sharon, <laughs> comment below. Is it this one? Is it the coach for you? <laughs> or my vintage snake print which one <laughs> okay you know I really like this vintage snake print my only concern is it's is it gonna be roomy enough let me see I, I, I want it to be this one but well, let's see I am just going to have to, I cannot carry this because this is going to be too bulky. So let me take out a card and my driver's license and carry my little pouch that has my house, want a house key in it and my car keys. So that's what I will do with that. Get in there. I know you fit because I do this all the time. <laughs> all right. Oh, it's giving me trouble now. Let's just drop this in here. Okay. So that's the key situation. Um, I, I never leave one without my tripod. Let's know if the tripod don't fit in here. That's when I got to leave it. Okay. All right. So that fits. 
Um, my earbuds. Let's see what. Oh yeah, yep. Yeah. I need my lipstick. <laughs> I am stuck on this Chanel neutral. Y'all love it, love it, love it, love it. Okay, my lipstick. What's in the fact of the matter is I really don't need it because when I tell you this thing lasts all day without any touch up, I don't really need to carry it, but I'm still carrying. <laughs> okay. My compact and my sponge. I think, let's see if I could fit these things in here then and my glasses then I'm going to take this will it fit will it fit will it fit and it fits I think it fits <laughs> yep it fits until I try to put my sunglasses in. I think I just need to make a small adjustment. One small adjustment. Because it actually has two pockets and I have everything stuffed in one pocket. Let's see. Okay. You know, I'll just have to leave that in the car to use when I need it because I don't need it in the training facility. But I'm taking it with me, but I'll just leave it in the car. I'll pull that when I need it. Okay. Here we go. We got it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we got it. Okay. So now let's select perfume. Um, <laughs> I, I was going to go pick up Clinique, <laughs> but let me try and leave Clinique alone for a little bit longer. Let me go with, um, Bulgari. Oh, oh, yeah. Bulgari is like, you forgot about me. Yeah. So today it's going to be Bulgari. <laughs> All right. Now sunglasses. I went back and forth. I thought maybe because you know I have the um this Versace and the color it just it's just like color of my boots. What do you think? Let's let's put the whole fit together with the sunglasses, the clutch. Do you think this works? Do you think this color works with the outfit? because it's kind of the color of the boots and I it kind of balanced me out it's at the top and the bottom <laughs> and in the middle you got all the neutrals you got color in the top color in the bottom and the neutrals in the middle I'm gonna go with it I am going with it yes so this is my look for today <laughs> We got it together, y'all. We got it together. I wasn't sure about it because I kind of pulled things heather, nether, heather, that, that, whatever. You know what I mean. In any event, thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate you. If you're watching me and not yet subscribed, please consider subscribing. Please, please, please. I would greatly appreciate your support. I am trying to get to 5,000 by December 31st, 2023. That's my goal. I can only do it with your help. <laughs> by the grace of God. <clears throat> I want to thank my subscribers. Thank you so, so very much. I really, really appreciate each and every one of you. And I shared about my mom and i got so many beautiful responses you know and i really really appreciate you guys i appreciate all the comments and everything because it's it just goes to show that you know we learn a lot from our parents even when we don't realize it 
So, if you want to continue supporting me, consider thumbs up, commenting, and sharing. I always say find a reason to smile. And um, my reason for smiling this morning also relates to my mom, but I won't go into that story because that's a long story and I'm running late. And my devotion this morning was Mark 14, 1 through 10. And in, in Mark 14, 1 through 10, they discussed about Jesus reclining in someone's house and the woman came with the very 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 expensive perfume and started um rubbing it in his hair and on his head and people were saying she, she was what a waste what a waste we could have sold that perfume and, and get the money and, and help the poor you know what a waste um, but what they didn't realize is that Jesus was only here temporarily and, and what she was doing, she needed to do. So when I read that, um, those scriptures, I think about us and I think about our life. It's temporary. It's all temporary. This is not permanent. And I hope we all know that it's temporary. So we need to make sure that the, the loved ones that we have around us, they know how we feel about them. We need to take the time to show them. We need to take the time to give them. We need to take the time to tell them how we feel about them. You know, my mother did something very, very special many, many, many years ago. Oh, uh, I said I wasn't going to tell the story. And here I am talking about it. Many, many years ago. And she took the entire family to Disney. My, the kids were little. She took the whole family to Disney and, and, and covered the cost. And we were like, Mom, why are you doing this? And she said, I want to see the smiles on your face now. So she recognized we need to do things now to show our love and appreciation, not later. So that's my reason for smiling. I, I, every time I read the Bible, I continue learning, picking up little nuggets that my mother implanted in me and the things that she did and the reasons behind what she did. And I'm forever grateful and thankful for that. So that's my reason for smiling. You find your reason to smile until next time. This is Sharon Singh. Bye-bye.